I hold it still. How do I squeeze it? <laughs> ah! <laughs> Hello everybody and welcome to Girl Talk World. Today we are here with Connie Hutt. Hello. 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 It's nice to be here. <laughs> Thank you for coming. And we are here Pleasure. because you have written a new book mm -hmm. called Cookie and the Most Annoying Boy in the World. So do you want to tell us a bit about it quickly? Yes, yeah, so this, can I just point out, this isn't the actual cover, this is a special reviewer's copy. Yes. So it won't Sneak look like peek. this. This is the special girl talk copy. It's about <laughs> a girl called Cookie, she's nine years old. Um, she sees the absurd in everyday life, like lots of us might do. Um, mm -hmm. And she, she's quite into science, hence we're going to be doing some science experiments. We are. Um, and this new boy comes along and he's a bit annoying. Oh no, I don't know that he's that annoying. She no. thinks he's annoying. Misunderstood. She, yeah, maybe. Mis yeah. yeah, that's a good. Have you read it? Yeah. Yeah. Of course How I've read brilliant it. is it? Is it brilliant? It's brilliant. Yeah, you're saying all the right things. Hurrah. Yeah. And so she does science experiments in the book. Yes. So we're doing some slightly different yes. ones today, but you can find the ones from the book in the back of the book as well. Yes. Fully written up with explanations. But today we are going to start with mm. rainbow on a plate. Right, well, it's very simple. We are going to start with some cotton wool balls and some washing up liquid. So if you pour some washing up liquid onto there, we're going to let it soak into some cotton wool balls. So pour Shall it onto there. Shall I pour there. it on? Shall I yeah, do that? Just Is a that bit my on job? There. You pour a I'm, bit on there. I'm your sous chef. <laughs> you're, you're the chef and I'm like, I'm assisting. Okay. Yes. More? Cool. You just that's, tell that's me good, when that's to, it. Is that it? Yeah, okay. and now all we want to do is put some cotton wool balls in there, just to soak it up a little bit. Okay. Mm, it's apple washing up <laughs> liquid. Cause I really like the apple scent. It's so really nice. It makes you almost want to eat something. Like it's quite yeah. sweet and apple isn't it? It's delish. Delish. Um, so now the next thing is to pour a bit of milk on a plate. Okay. Now we've used whole milk and that is actually important because it's the highest fat content, which is important. We'll explain later. That's for the science bit. I'm feeling quite big petery right now. Cool, good, good. <laughs> okay, so next thing, we need to put some food coloring into our milk. Okay. Now, we tried this with just one drop of each and it wasn't good enough. So, do like three drops of each. You can use as many colors as can I you do like. Too? Yeah, 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 do it as okay. well. One, plop, Okay, I've done four. Plop. I'm gonna do four. Then... You can't out drop me. <laughs> there we go. You've done them in lines. Am I not supposed to? No, I love it. That's so organised. Is it? Yeah. Oh, no, I was just, I didn't know. I don't really know what's happening, so I'm just doing it <laughs> however. Next thing Amazing. is take a cotton wool ball, which has the washing up liquid on it, and now I'm going to put it in here. So we've got a camera above. Is that going to pick everything up? Hi. Okay. Ready? Yeah. Just put it in the middle. Like what? This. Shall I just do that? Oh no, mine won't work because it's it will, weird. It will. It will. Okay. Wow. And then it travels out. The colours are all like all over the shop. I'm going to stir up a bit. Wow, it's very pretty. The thing is, with the milk, it's really fatty. Mm. And then the washing up liquid sort of attacks that fat. So when you put that on, it travels all across the milk, like attacking all the fat, and it carries all the food colouring with it. It's very clever. Yeah. I like this experiment. Science experiment. Done. <laughs> okay, so now, now, next experiment, we are making a lava lamp in a bottle. Cool. Again, one you've tried before? I, uh, yeah, but I don't know if the ingredients are exactly the same, but, ah. but yeah, some form of it, because it's to do with emissible liquids, isn't it? Yeah, with. oil and water don't mix, so it goes all exactly. Exactly. Mm. Okay, so do you want? I feel like you like the food coloring after the last experiment, so we'll we'll make this together. Yes. So first things first, mm -hmm. we start with about a third of water, and we're going to make it blue just nice. for fun. Why not? Because we can. Oh, and. Don't worry, I do have kitchen towel in case I spill this everywhere. No, it looks like you're doing a good Is job. It going in? Yeah, it's going in. The more okay. you tip it, the less likely it will be to spill. But there, yeah, yeah, you go. How much have I put in now? Yeah. Where am I? Oh, this is going in way more slowly than I thought. The more you tip it, yes, it. There that's we it. You've go. got it going on. You're learning how to pour water into a bottle. You're doing really well. Every day's a school day. 
Okay. Cool. <laughs> okay. That's All right. True. Life is an education. <laughs> it right. is. Okay, so we can add some blue. Okay. To how that. many drops does one want? Mm. How many did one want? Mm. How many do you want? I want a few. No. Go for it. Okay. <laughs> Splurge. There we go. <laughs> Have I done too much? Yeah. No, it's good. It's good. I mean, we want to be able to see it, right? Yeah. There we go. We can definitely see it. Cool. Okay. Now. Pouring the oil in. Okay. Do you want to do this? This one oil. I feel like I would make a big mess of. Okay, good luck with this, everyone. Say stop. So I think pour pour the whole lot in. <gasps> the whole the whole whole. Well, we have gone for quite a big bottle. You can use a smaller bottle for this. Oh no, now I'm making a mess. We have wipes, it's fine. Good. We've got all the mod cons here. <laughs> nice. Next step, mm -hmm. we're adding baking powder. Nice. Do you want to do it? Okay, I can do that. <laughs> okay. There you go. Da, da, da. So we can add, yeah, see if you can get all that in. Oh, if God. we make a mess, we'll just. On, I've got a better way to do it. Shall, am I, how much do you want in there? We can go for a teaspoon or so, yeah. I mean, that's good. More? That's good. Have <laughs> I gone wild? It should Looks be like fine. cauliflower. <laughs> Woses. Now that. Woses. Is great. Nice. Okay. You know, all of these experiments so far have been really satisfying to watch. They are, right? I mean, yeah. things like slime and squishies, they're really satisfying. Or you can make a science experiment. Science is good. Science is good. Now we have... An orange peel? An orange peel. And an orange? Now, if you're afraid... And a brilliant book <laughs> that you will all love. Sorry, carry on. It is brilliant and you will all love it. Listen to her. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so as long as you're not afraid of loud noises, mm. we've got another experiment for you. If you are afraid of loud noises, just pop your fingers in your ears because we've got an orange peel and we have a balloon. Let me guess, the balloon is going to pop and that will be our loud noise. It is going to pop. Well, hopefully, this is what we want to happen. Okay. And it's just going to happen from squeezing orange peel next to it. Wowzers! That's just so <gasps> Who'd have believed it? Who'd have known? Go on, do it, do it. Okay, now let's see if I can actually do it. So there's a chemical in here. Okay, shall I? That will make it go, hopefully. Oh, how, how do you squeeze an orange peel? Shall I hold it still? How do I squeeze it? Ah! Ah! <laughs> there you go. That's what? how you squeeze what? orange what? peel. Why did it do that? So it's got something in it called limonene or limonene, mm -hmm. and it dissolves Balloons. a part of the balloon. Ah. Should we do it again? Just do, do it again. Do it? There you okay. go. I've got another one, a slightly smaller balloon. So if Are you, you want to be a killjoy at your friend's birthday party, <laughs> just take this around and do that. Oh, if your parents. Oh, look at that. She's I can see waft. like smoky waftingness. <laughs> well, my squeezing's obviously not very good. <laughs> Here's a lesson as well. If you have yeah. a party mm, and your parents nice. have spent a lot of money on balloons, don't serve oranges. So if you don't like oranges, get your parents to get balloons for your party and then you're sorted. <laughs> Are you ready for our final trick? I am ready and raring to go. <laughs> I'm saying trick like it's magic. It basically is. It's a science experiment though. Mm. Okay, so we have here a narwhal, Hello. important, and some water Cute. beads and some water. So these you can get, I think they're supposed to be for plants or something, and they come as like these tiny pellets. And then you add water and they soak it all up and they become like this. And they're so much fun to they're play so with. They're so nice, aren't they? Yeah, but they're really bouncy, so if we lose any, they'll go in far. Um, okay, so yeah. what we do is mm -hmm. we just put this narwhal in here. Okay, bye, -bye. Gonna dive. Go in, and dive you can, deep. And you can see like, it's kind of disappeared. Like, I don't you, I mean, see it. You can see it through some of them slightly. I can see its nose. Can you see its little yeah. nose there? <laughs> little normal yeah. nose. It wants to see what's going on. Nose. So it's effectively sort of disappeared. Nose. And Sorry, now yes. mm -hmm. we're going to make it appear again. <gasps> Magic! No, science. 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 <laughs> Cookie would be impressed, right? Cookie would be very impressed. She loves a bit of science, does Cookie. Yeah. Uh, who is the star of this fantastic book, <laughs> which is out in August, and you will devour it. It's really good. It's addictive. It's it, a page turner. It is. Yeah. And so she does a 
Well, she enters the science competition. She does. And she makes a solar system. We can't system, tell you whether she wins or not, because that's no. a spo spoiler. Yeah. I was going to say spoiler. But, spoiler. Spoiler. A spoiler. Spoiler alert. But, I mean, this would be a great one for a science yes. test at school. Okay. okay, so now, mm -hmm. what we're going to do is pour water in. <gasps> wow, will you take a look at that? And then, you can actually see the I narwhal see again. The narwhal. He's that is pretty magic. I love that. And it's just because the light, the way the light travels through the water, travels in exactly the same way through these balls, so it considers them the same. So they effectively... It's, it's to do with diffraction or refraction or something like that. It's where how it's light travels. Yeah, refraction, refraction. Yeah. How light travels through different substances. Yes. Yeah. So we found our narwhal. Yay! <laughs> narwhal, you're safe. <laughs> Thank you. So I hope you liked all these science experiments. If you did, and you love science anyway, and you love reading, we check it out. Yeah. <laughs> and if you like this video, give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to the Girl Talk World channel. Yeah, subscribe! And we'll see you soon. Bye!